Hello friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Michaela, and I make adult coloring and diamond painting videos here on this channel. And today I have the first of probably many Halloween coloring book flip through videos for you guys this season. If you guys are new to my channel, I love Halloween. I don't even have a good reason, but you know, a lot of people are like, oh, October, spooky season, whatever. No, I, the second 4th of July is done is when it's spooky season, which is kind of not true. I don't really do it that early, but August to me is kind of the beginnings of spooky season for me. And then September, I really get into it. And then October, I really like to push into it, but usually by that point, I'm burnt out a little bit. But today I have the first of probably many flips for you guys of newly released um, Halloween fall coloring books. This is Nightmare Fuel by Color Questopia. I was literally just talking to Ash, Simply Ash here on YouTube, about this this weekend that I have not bought a Color Questopia book in probably a year. Um, I believe the last book I bought from them was actually their last Halloween release, was, which was like a witch's book. I haven't bought anything since, but then I saw this book come out, and you guys, I fell in love. I think this is so neat. Um, I don't hate the creepy, gory, freaky, if it's Halloween themed kind of books. Um, I do hope that they come out with another cutesy one. They've had a couple cutesy ones in the past, a couple horror ones in the past, but like I said, this is Nightmare Fuel, and it just looks so cool. So if if you guys are not into creepy gory creepy gory creepy I don't know if you're not into the creepy stuff you might not want to watch this video um, but if you are into it and you want to see a flip through of this book keep watching and I will leave a link down below if it is something you want to pick up for yourself but that's enough chit chat let's get right into the video okay so the cover is super cool but moving right along just got the title page of course nothing nothing crazy um, what I think is really, really awesome of Color Questopia is that they give you a QR code if you want to get a digital copy of their, like, I think it's like their 100 color by number book. It has, like, one page from a lot of their books, which is so cool. But, yeah, Color Questopia has a ton of books. But like I said, I haven't really been uh, keeping up with them for the last year just because the things that they've released haven't really been my style. But this book really brought me back to my roots. If you guys didn't know, I used to color qu color color questopia all the time and yeah, I just haven't really. Um, but yeah, okay, so this book I believe I purchased for $5.99, which is their early release price. So definitely go snatch it up. I'm pretty sure their pricing is still going on. I think I'm going to try to upload this video today. So definitely go pick up the book now if you want the early release pricing. I'm like 99% certain it's going to be there for another couple of days. I feel like usually they do about a week and then they're done with the early release pricing. Um, but otherwise, I think their normal price is like $8.99. And um, on the other side of the page, which I haven't been showing you, you get their color palette, which um, you also get on the back of the book. It is a 24 color palette and then any flesh tone um, as well in some of these pages. But I love that they only list that the colors you will need. Uh, but yeah, this book is just really cool and it gives me like vibes of their older books that I used to really enjoy from them. I'm not really sure exactly maybe what happened um, but I feel like at some point they started maybe having different artists on their team and their style of drawing wasn't my thing and the line work was a little too thin in a lot of the pages and it just wasn't really my thing so I wasn't picking up their books but like I said I feel like this book has kind of brought back the roots of what I personally have enjoyed from Color Questopia in the past. Um, and I feel like their Halloween releases last year for the most part were also very similar. Um, but like, do I really need any more Halloween books, especially from Color Questopia? Probably not. But I, you know, I will never say no to a good Halloween coloring book. I, I just love Halloween, so I will never say no. And of, of course this book is creepy. It's so creepy, <laughs> but I think it's fun, so. I think this is a fun one for sure. Yeah, definitely let me know in the comments if you plan on picking this book up um, at any point. I, I know spooky season is pretty far away still for most people. So definitely understand if you're not going to pick it up quite yet. But 
super fun and I'm excited. I believe um, Alexandra Francis is coming out with a new like Halloween chibi book. Um, I believe she had mentioned something about that. So I'm hoping that wasn't just like a weird rumor <laughs> that it actually is a thing because I absolutely love her chibis. So I'm hoping that's a thing. Um, otherwise, yeah, I'm just excited for some more Halloween books this season. Um, I genuinely have more Halloween books than I know how to color in, but they're very fun. I love them. And it's kind of the same with diamond paintings. I have way too many fall Halloween themed diamond paintings. Um, those I'm better at working on non-Halloween time than I am coloring Halloween, even though I know I can color anything any time of year, and I'm a big advocate of that. If you guys have been around for any length of time, you have heard me say that time and time again, but this one's so cool. I love it. I love this book. I feel like instead of the word cute, this book I'm using the word cool because is this really cute? Not really. I mean, it kind of is, right? In like a creepy gory kind of way. But I hope everyone has been doing well. Um, I think I'm going to upload in a day or two my July haul for you guys. And then I'm going to film my finished pages videos and upload that too in a couple days. So definitely keep an eye out for some more videos from me. And then I'm hoping this weekend, um, today's Friday, I'm hoping this weekend to finish my diamond painting that I'm working on. I only have a few more sections. So then hopefully my post review can go up for that. So definitely expect some fun videos from me within the next week or two. I know I'm very excited to be back in the YouTube groove. I just think that making the executive decision for myself of um, combining my channel into a diamond painting coloring channel has been really um, freeing, if you will. That way I'm not like really just focusing on one, especially because now that I'm into both hobbies so much that it's like, I'm not gonna just do one or the other, I'm gonna film both stuff. And whoever wants to watch the diamond painting stuff can, whoever, wanna wa whoever wants to watch the coloring stuff also can, and then hopefully, maybe at some point, like someone will be like, oh, I found this hobby, you know, through you because I was watching your other hobby, you know what I mean? I don't know, maybe that won't happen, but <laughs> it would be pretty neat, so. Anyways, yeah, this one, oh my gosh, this one is wild, oh gosh, and they're in like, okay, they're in the dirt, I was confused, I, honestly, this would be interesting if it was like green, like, but it makes sense that it's brown, because it's like dirt. These are so creepy, and I love it. Oh, I need to color more Color Quest Dope. Yeah, I actually pulled out my summer book this month and colored in it, and I was like, oh, so easy, so chill, why don't I do this more often? <laughs> I don't know what it is. I just like you. I feel like other colorists understand that you have so many books and such little time, and then other hobbies on top of it. And it's like, I don't know what to color. So, yeah, that was the end of the book. And then at the end of all of Color Questopia's books, they have bonus pages. So, oh goodness, we are really going back to my, my roots personally. I got this book back in 2020 when it, I think it was 2020 when it came out. I'm pretty sure. Oh my gosh. Too good, too good. Oh man, the ones who know, know. <laughs> too good, too good. Oh my gosh, this one also I believe came out in 2020. I started really coloring in 2020 and posting on my Instagram in 2020. And um, I remember Color Questopia sent me, I believe this Halloween coloring book to review on my Instagram and I was just thrilled. Um, so it's just, it's so funny. I got it in the white background though, not the black. Uh, we have Halloween Patterns, which I don't actually think I own. I think this is one of the books that I did not pick up last year, um, if I remember correctly. So I do not believe that I have this book. Uh, Halloween, Halloween Nightmare was one of their 2021 releases. Um, this one's also really fun. This one was like the creepy version of the two, and I'm kind of wondering if they have one page of the cute Halloween. We're about to find out. No, they don't. Okay. They have a page from 100 Seasons Color by Number. Oh, a nice little fall page. Love that. I considered picking this book up when it came out, but I already have the fall patterns. And honestly, that's the one book I think I care about just because fall is like my favorite season to color from for sure. So yeah. And then of course, at the back of the book, they just have custom color charts and they have a few of them. So you can just go, also you guys were definitely not seeing the top of the page. <laughs> so you can test out some colors, color testing sheet and then leave us a review, the norm, and yeah, like I said, the back of the book just has the color palette and 
that is it for this flip through video. I hope like the entire video was not out of frame, but I'm pretty sure, pretty sure I was good if I was like, yeah, I might have just been a little bit up like this. But anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments. If you guys are planning on picking this book up, I would love to know. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you in my next video. Bye, guys!